Mrs. Metrophile, where you get gist on glitz, glamour, and parties. Welcome to another 30 minutes, which will have you glued to channels television as you enjoy the details of a fashion show, a marriage celebration, and a special birthday party. Mrs. Falake Majin joined the fashion industry over 18 years ago. Today, she stands with her head high as she showcases her work along with her two daughters at Shona Freak Fashion Show. of Pastor and Deaconess David Olaoye of Okemesi in Ekiti State and late Mr. Feishayo Edgar of Sabungi Daora of Edo State and Mrs. Adeboale Doduromola of Owo in Edo State were glad witnesses as their children Okpayemi and Uludayo legalized their love. Senator O.C. Tauzinaso from Olu Senatorial District of Imo State has found a noble way of celebrating his birthday. Every 30th of October, he puts smiles on the faces of the physically challenged. Beautiful clothes, exquisite styles, bright colors. These define the atmosphere at Shona Freak Fashion Show, which was held in Lagos State. An evening of fashion, the hall full of ladies and gentlemen who have taken time to look good with added touches that will make them stand out at Shona Freak Fashion Show by Folake Majin. At a closer observation, it looked like the ladies outnumbered the men with personalities like Mrs. Abimbola Fashola, the wife of the governor of Lagos State, Mrs. Abba Falawio, a matriarch of high street fashion in Nigeria, Chief Oprah Benson, the Yaogi of Lagos, Betty Rabo, publisher of Genevieve magazine, Adesua Unique of Today's Woman, Tara Feladuro Toye, founder of Tara House International, and a host of others. The models started rolling out with the outfit first, the Royal Collection by Folake Majin. The collection showed Mrs. Majin's preference and creativity in simple but exquisite dresses for celebratory occasions as well as official purposes. of approval from the audience. I love laces. The lighter the better, I like the Chantilly laces, the French laces, I like Swiss laces. I love fabrics, I have a passion for fabrics. If I wasn't a fashion designer, I'd probably be a textile merchant.
interludes in the show, first from praise, run up of MTN's project fame. And the next set of outfits by Gogo Margin Tag, Circle Revolution by Gogo Margin for Folake Margin, GM for FM. Portraying the youthfulness of its creator, the outfit came out sassy and vibrant in style. captured by paparazzi. All the outfits show the ghost definition of the circle revolution. The inspiration for the collection came from a circle accessory that my mom, one of the circle accessories my mom hand makes and custom makes in her store. So I began to look at it and I was like, okay, you know what, I can build a collection around this. And then I called it the circle revolution because your fashion kind of moves in a circle, you know, 50s come back to the 2010s and you know, blah, blah, blah. So I thought, you know, a uh, circle revolution, also using the fabrics in ways that they've never been used before, using old vintage ashoke and making them glamorous outfits with international appeal. This time from Tiwa Savage. Next on the runway was Miss Margin's collection, Start Breathless Experience. Everything, you know, but the end result 
images, it has to be beautiful, it has to be fun, and uh, you know, loads of style. So, yeah. Then the final outing, another set from Royal Collection by Folaka Imagine, another avenue for her to show off her 18 years of practice in the fashion industry. The Royal Collection is about beautiful things, uh, uh, beautiful clothes, classic clothes, wearable clothes. Yeah. We present to you the MTM yellow dress with Mrs. Matthew. When the host for the night came out, the ovation was loud. It grew even louder when she walked to the stage again with her daughters. 